Hello guys, welcome to my channel Python Edit Care. Today I have brought another interesting session on desktop view automation where I'll be showing you how to automate the installation of an application. Uh, for this, first of all, you need to import a module called PyUSC. You need to install this module using pip install PyUSC. And like what you need to do is like you need to go to your USC user access control and you need to make sure like this is disabled. Okay. Now, <coughs> first of all, we need to make sure like whether we are running as uh, whether you are uh, logged into the system as admin or not. So to bypass, if you are not logging as admin, then just have this. Uh, if not, PyUSC is user admin. PyUSC dot run as admin. Else main. Got it? If it is not admin, then it runs admin. Else it will run the main directly. So now. I have a function define main. So here app equal to application dot start command line. What is the application I'm going to install? It is in my same uh, folder Win SCP. This is the application I'm going to install. Then time dot slip dot two. Uh, so you can put one second also for just demo purpose. I'm just increasing a delay, but you can have uh, one second. Yes. So first, what I'm gonna do is like this. I will show you manually what actually I'm gonna do. Then I will explain the script line by line. So whenever I'm st uh, starting the replication exe, so we are getting this particular uh, window or wizard. So what I'm gonna do is like if install for users or install for install for all users or install for me only. So if you are looking for install for all users, directly send key enter press enter key. If you are looking for install for me only, then go for a uh, down key arrow down key what you need to do is like for that send keys like we have up here you can put down and then press enter if you are looking for this but in our case we are looking for install for all, all users so it is already selected by default so we'll just press enter so the first enter is for install for all users so let me press enter so once i press this enter i'm getting this window so let me put a delay here also now once again the next window appears so again what I need to do is like I need to press and enter. So if you press enter it is going to directly accept it. So here if you see like it is by default in custom custom installation. So what I am going to do is like I will be uh, selecting typical installation radio box. So I just I will press up arrow. So it is selecting over there and if you want to go down you can press down and then this and then press enter. Now this is a radio button in some uh, installation wizards we have chat boxes. So for for selecting checkboxes, what you do is like go uh, instead of uh, go up and press space or go down, press space. For radio button, it is selecting directly when you are pressing up and down. But instead of in case of checkboxes, you need to press uh, up and then press space, send key space. So up and then for selecting the checkboxes, use send key space. Then only that particular checkbox will get selected. So we don't have anything here. So we'll just go with typical radio button, typical installation. Then we go for press enter. Then uh, we got commander explorer, so we'll stay stick with the commander, and then we'll press enter, and then finally we'll install the application. Press enter, install the application. So this is what I, I did. Enter. Then I waited for two seconds. Then enter. Then again I uh, I want to select this up radio button, so press this up, and then again send key enter, enter, enter. So it's very simple, right, guys? So let us execute this uh, script. See, so I'm going to press up and then enter. Then again, I'm going to enter the install. See, it is installing the application. Now uh, I didn't. Read, uh, I have I have not written the code for finish. So here, if you, I think I missed this part, so this is check boxes here. I could have shown here by selecting. But anyway, like see, by manually if I do right, if I go up, I press space, it is unselected. If I press space, it is getting selected. So this way you can show it. This way you can do it. And then press enter. Enter means we have to finish. It's finished. 
so hope you guys have understood this video and uh, yes if you have liked this video please place like button and for more videos please do subscribe my channel thank you for watching